Imagine being able to create hundreds of social media graphics in literally minutes. That's exactly what I did with this crazy AI agent. And before we jump into the demo, you know what to do. Like and share so more people can see this. All right, this is unbelievable. If you work in social media, you probably create graphics for your business, for your clients. We used to do it manually, then we hired people from Upwork, then we moved on to Canva, but now, this AI agent with a simple text command will create hundreds of graphics for you in different niches. So the agent I want to show you is FlowWid. So FlowWid, uh, their agent Neo. This is how you turn on the agent mode. Agent Neo, it has unlimited memory and it can do the execution forever. You can give it a task and then go to sleep. It will just keep on executing your task. Uh, it is so useful and powerful. All right, now let me show you, this is what the dashboard looks like. I'm already signed into my account. So flowwith.io, that's the URL. So very, very simple interface. Uh, if you wanna just not use the agent and just use the simple chatbot, you can turn on, turn off the agent mode. But let me show you some of the use cases, how with simple text commands, I was able to create amazing and useful uh, in uh, graphics for my social media profiles. So the first example I want to show you, here's the, and it, it creates uh, and saves the history of all the execution. So you can see right here. So this was my prompt right here. So let's look at the prompt, create 10 social media graphics for unexpected ways people use chat GPT. So I wanted graphics with I have a brand, a faceless brand, where we talk a lot about ChatGPT. So these graphics are for that brand. Use plain background that make sure and make sure the text is readable. So I'm not giving it even the text. I'm not giving it the quotes. I wanted to go do research, find the quotes, and then put those on plain back, uh, background. And I did find some um, a website that has some examples. So I gave it. I found this uh, one source that was uh, good use cases, and then I give it a link. And then it started doing the research. Uh, by the way, the first thing it does is, you can see all the steps it took. So it's gonna read the provided uh, article, analyze, and then create 10 social media code graphics. Uh, and then it's gonna create simple web page to show all of them. And then you can see, here's it, it did the next step, the next step, and then it was able to create all the graphics for me. Look at this. Transcribe it, summarize hidden uh, handwritten notes by uploading a single photo. Feed ChatGPT your fridge uh, to generate recipe. Ooh, that's a really cool use case. So this is the code graphic that's gonna create a lot of engagement because it's really relatable. Not many people might know about this one. It will get people excited. So these will get people talking on that social media. And it was able to create all of these graphics without me doing any, uh, anything. And then if I scroll down, uh, here are some more, because I give it some uh, additional instruction. I said, uh, actually use a title, hidden ways to use ChatGPT 6. So here's the another code graphic. And then it, hidden ways to use ChatGPT number eight, use ChatGPT as a therapy style con conversation partner to work through your thoughts. So again, if I had to create this in Canva, it would have taken me, you know, at least an hour yeah you can do some automation you can create a csv upload into template but it'll still take you more than a few minutes but this was all done in just a few seconds all right that was like use case number one number two kitchen hacks and actually this is really cool i think you're gonna love this one all right in this case i give it the uh the actual text so let's i said generate social media graphics for these kitchen hack ideas below Use the text and the graphics to make it look appealing. Create separate uh, graphic for each idea. And then I give it like these ideas right here. So I give it how many ideas? So about 20 ideas, right? So in the first example, I did not give it any text, but in this example, I'm giving it some ideas uh, and I wanna make sure it puts the right text. Cause a lot of like AI image generation tools, they mess up the text still. And then it started doing the work and pretty quickly you can see Kitchen hack number three, and there you go. And it came, the graphics are amazing, don't you think? And literally in seconds, it was able to create these graphics for me. There you go. 
All right, and then I gave it some more instructions and it was able to create all the graphic. What the cool thing about uh, Flow with is you can see all the steps it took and you can all see visually different ways that kind of like a flow chart. Oh, I love that. Kitchen hack, separate uh, egg yolks cleanly. Prevent onion tears, that's amazing. And obviously these are for a brand that has something to do with the kitchen appliances. Kitchen Hacks is gonna be a perfect fit. And we were able to create these graphics in literally, actually without doing anything, we just gave it a command and then it went and did all the work for us and give us all the graphics. And then here is kind of like an infographic and then it is done, the task is done. So literally from simple commands, you're able to create uh, graphics. Let me. Uh, pick another one, social media graphics. Here's another one. Actually, this is another really, really cool example because in this uh, case, I said generate social media graphics for these blog articles and I just give it the links of blog articles. So first example, I did not give it any text. It did research, created the graphics. Second example, I gave it some text and it created amazing graphics. In the third example, I'm giving it the blogs because what I want to do is I want to take the the blogs and let me show you one of these. Let's see if I can open this uh, blog article for you. So it's a blog for one of our clients, the business security, the locking systems. And this is what the blog is, right? Let's go back and then I give it, I give it like three links, right? But can you imagine? I could give it 10, I could give it 50, I could give it 100 from your blog and then it will create graphics for all of them. Um, so here's a kind of like a cool use case. If you, have a, if you have a client or maybe you have a lot of like blog articles, so scrape all the URLs and then you can use Agent Neo from Flowit to create graphics for all of them in literally seconds. Again, you can see all the steps here, it's going through those blog articles, it's analyzing. And then if you scroll down, it is, it created the graphics for me. Here's the number one, perfect. And also it kept the, this is exactly the green and the black are the brand color for that. And here is the graphic number three. Pretty cool. This would have taken us at least, you know, a few minutes to make it in Canva if we knew Canva inside and out, right? We hire people, we used to hire people who were expert at Canva. It would still take them a few minutes, more than five minutes maybe to create graphics like this. And now in literally seconds, this is kind of like your design assistant, your social media assistant, your social media VA with uh, Flow, uh, Flow with Agent Neo. And I can give you hundreds of ex uh, other examples, but you get the point. Just go to Flow with, sign up, and then you're gonna have agent mode and then just say whatever you want, you know, create social media graphics for whatever, give it your uh, blogs, your website URL, uh, maybe give it text or have it do the research for you because it can also do research and create or just create based on what you give it. Uh, it can do anything and everything. Again, infinite uh, memory, infinite execution. It can, you can go to sleep and I have some tasks that run every single day and then I get the results in the email using flow with. Unbelievable. Any questions, let me know before you go like and share this video so more people can see this. And now I'll see you in this next video. Bye for now.